Hey, what's up, everybody? Larry here. If you see that time of the month, Fright Crate, July 2019. Yeah, so just got home from work. We got the July Fright Crate on the front porch. Um, like as always, if you want to go get a Fright Crate, go get one at www.frightcrate.net. Hit them up on Facebook, whatever, Instagram, Twitter. Um, quote on the front, all of us have our individual curses, something that we are comfortable with and something that we can deal with or that we have to, or something we have to deal with. Okay, let's try that again. All of us have our own individual curses, something that we are comfortable with and something that we have to deal with. Got it that time. Don't remember any of the themes. Which makes it more of a surprise. Although I do think Killer Clowns from Outer Space might have been in this one. Not sure. Alright. Paper on top. First is the shirt. It is a shirt from Alien. A lot of times... Um... I, uh... I've got so many damn horror shirts now that usually I don't even keep the shirts anymore. I just throw them on eBay or something. But, I do like this shirt. So, I am keeping this one. Pretty bad shirt. I love all the green colors with the lines. Very nice. Got Ripley. Got Xenomorph. <clears throat> A little face hugger coming out of the egg. Good looking shirt. I like that one. Then we have, um, I'm guessing this is a figure or a bust, most likely. I will put this to the side. We have a Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Yeah, I can see that. Texas Barbecue. It's got Leatherface on it. Let me check this out because I have no clue what this is. It's not a shirt, of course, because we already have a shirt. And it feels a lot heavier like thicker like more of a nylon thickness Texas barbecue oh sweet it's a barbecue apron established 1974 this is perfect for me if y'all don't know I fucking love barbecuing I do it all the time um and I'm in Texas and this is one of my favorite movies ever so I do have a apron that I hardly never wear but I will start wearing this one for now on probably. That's cool. I really, really like that. Because uh, instead of just getting shirts all the time, even though we still got a shirt, um, throw something else in there. Like, I would love to have m uh, more hats or fucking the beanies, toboggans, whatever you want to call them. Fucking I love those. Um, some socks. Have some boxers, whatever. I know there's guys and girls, so I guess you can't really do boxers. But you can do socks. But yeah. Next, we have the pin... Heels have eyes. Ah, oh, fuck it. We have the, this is a print. I still hope it was an autograph, but it's just a print. Max Cave. It's the Exorcist. And the last item, which has to be a serial resin piece because we haven't had one this last item. And, um, I'm not sure. <laughs> I thought Killer Clowns was in this box. I guess that's maybe that's next month. So, uh, maybe, I'm sorry, I can't think. Maybe a prom, like prom night or something? Let me look at the spoiler cards. We have Ripley's Nightmare shirt. Yes, shirt was badass. Bloody Carry bust. Okay, I was right. Um, Texas barbecue apron. I actually love that. Uh, Exorcism of Reagan print by Max Cave. And the heels enamel pin. Cool. Not a bad box. I fucking love the apron and the shirt by far. Um... 
Next month, we have The Shining, Return of the Living Dead, Killer Clowns. Okay, that's next month. And Children of the Corn. So awesome. I'm, I'm really excited for Killer Clowns and Return of the Living Dead. So cool. Frat Craig, July 2018. Go get you a box. Tell them that um, you watched my video. Give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment. You know, all that good stuff. Whatever you want to do. Appreciate y'all watching. Deuces.